Hello everybody, Berto Guy here, and welcome back to the crust. Alright, so... <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, after the last episode, I realized something, and I feel pretty stupid um, knowing this now anyways, right? Because then this could have came in for previous planning, and I might not have wasted as many materials as we did, but not really wasted, right? Um, so... Yes, yes, wasted. I'm <laughs> not going to lie, but it was just pure waste. Um, so I was looking at our, our beautiful nodes here, and I was like, oh, um, this one's got 60%, uh, this one's got 47%. But then I just kind of, like, started, like, going down the list, and then I'm like, I got to the bottom, like, or amount. And I'm like, ooh. And then I went and checked this one, and I'm like, ooh. And I was like, oh, so <laughs> what that's saying is we don't have infinite resources in these little nodes, um, unlike satisfactory, right? Um, so that's going to really force us in a really interesting direction. And I was doing a little bit of um, layout planning and all that kind of stuff. And I think I found an awesome solution to our problem now we already had it researched and we're going to be looking into a multi regolith refinery and the reason why we were looking into mrr is because if you look at the output for five regolith you get one of each now if we go to our normal regolith refinery which is right next to it for every two regolith, you actually only get one. So for 2.5 more percent, I guess, in a sense, like times the amount that we're, we're, we're wasting here, we can actually get one of each instead for five. You get the you get the last one at the end of the slag, so you always get slagged no matter what. So really, you're still getting it's a one it's a one one to one, but it's easier to get it here because you're not wasting all those materials. But anyways, it, it's just better if we do, do it this way. Right? So I was thinking that we need to do a little bit of uh, a fixer upper episode. And um, we're going to obviously leave all of this going, right? Uh, the only thing I'm going to do is turn off all the miners. So that way we're not using any more of the resources in these. Um, pretty luckily they're all they're all centered in the middle here. Okay, I think those are all stopped. Oh, we just got these one down here. That's true. Can't forget about that one. Alright, so that's step one. Step two is make sure that um, these guys stop putting regolith in there. And that they'll never put any in here. All right, perfect. So then that way we're not wasting it here. And then we could just put another pot over here somewhere and have them bring it all into there instead. I think that's a better idea. Step number two. Up here, our CPU capacity. We need to deal with that. Um, in order to upgrade our capacity, we're going to have to buy a few things. Well, one thing, but a few of them. So these microprocessors are used into making the the CPUs. And I think I'm just going to buy like 10 of these. And I think we should be okay. All right. So we'll claim that. We'll have it dropped off here. That's perfect. Then we'll go back into here. And I want to create some more of these. And I think that's what I wanted to do. And we'll just let those start building. Because that's important. And then... We're going to need a little bit of box here. So I suggest that we go and we check out some contracts. So if we look in here... i pause the game just for now. Um, if we look in here, we got all kinds of different factions that we can sell stuff to. Um, and the list is quite extensive you know what i mean you got lots of people i guess x space is like a 
a knockoff of Elon Musk. If you actually look at the guy, he almost looks like Elon Musk. <laughs> That's pretty funny. So you can get different um, amounts of money for stuff that you uh, that you complete. So we'll just look for a contract that's half decent, uh, that pays a decent amount for something that's not going to... Uh, this wouldn't be too bad. 44,000 either. Titanium and that. Um, how much titanium do I have? Only 200 and some. 25 of those. All right, so I give me like a hundred grand between the two of those contracts. That's not too bad, I guess. Where were those here? Huh? Let's go check elsewhere. Okay, so five hundred. That's a lot. Uh, it's pretty kind of crappy. I do have fuel. How much fuel do I have? I did pick some up. Um. resources do, do, do. we got 361 fuel all right let's do that one because i just picked that stuff up off the map so let's where was that this one here seventy-four thousand for fuel all right so we'll accept it we're going to send you some fuel oh it's in a transport too and that transport is on its way there um are you completing a contract i think you are that's unfortunate or is that where you're going where is this truck what are you doing uh on its way on its way where I would love to know. Uh, interesting. Okay, so you're going there. Maybe. No, that was the contract that I'm, I just accepted. Where did I send you to? There, maybe? Can I cancel you and just send you back to base I think that's all I'll do and then we'll set that expedition up there we go so you should do that that'll make us some money let's go back here and I guess get a different contract. Maybe we should look to see if it was off world or not, right? <laughs> um so Earth Earth. You're looking for 85. I don't have 85, I only had in the 60s. It's unfortunate. A thousand bricks. Man, I'll give you a thousand bricks. I make lots of bricks. So for your resource, you just watch the number. Oh, there you go. Close enough. And then you just send them all back to back. That's good enough. And then it'll just be one more. And there. Drones are going to be pretty busy. So they're just going to go give it everything they got. Uh, where's that other drone? Is he on his way back yet? Because I don't know. How long was that contract for? Uh, 100 days. Oh, okay. I'm not bad. I should have lots of time to do that. And I think I was just sending that other rover somewhere for God knows what. Doing 19 days. And I think that's the, uh, this one right here. Yeah. For the bricks. But we'll be fine. I think we'll be fine. We got like lots of bricks, so. Um, so we're just gonna let them do that, and when I'm done making all the money, I'll be back. Alright, so we got 140k. That's pretty good. That other one is still on its way. 
um, to deliver the gas to get more money. So if we're really hurting for money, well, we have some backup. Now we got a little bit more CPU. So now we can start planning out what I want to do. Okay. So we're going to start off with our a regolith factory. We're going to flip it so that way that the slag is going this way. And then I uh, just want to align my camera right. All right. So let's see. Yeah. Yeah, right there. Right there looks good. All right, so now we got one of these, right? And we had it so that way that the purple was facing down. And we can confirm that by just looking at it. So the iron and titanium are at the top, and the aluminum and silicone are at the bottom, okay? So we got to remember that because in order to have this work out very cleanly, um, we're going to have to like, uh, make sure we flip things properly. Right. So for this first one, one, two, three, gotta be always three apart to make this work. Otherwise it's just not going to work. Um, I don't think that's going to be in the way of the bells. I think the bells will be able to go over top of that. I think we'll be fine. All right, so we're going to copy that one. And then we're going to go three again. But now the iron is on the top. So this one stays normal. So we can leave that one as is. And I was thinking maybe just three of these for now would be enough to furnish all the ones that we have right now. Maybe and if not, well, we can just add a few more, right? I'm okay with backing up on the regolith and not necessarily having to produce it as it's coming out. Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll work it out. We'll work it out. Okay, so now the whole belt thing, the whole belt thing. I, I I kind of figured out a pretty decent way of getting all the materials with using very little belts. Hopefully. So we're going to need, I'm going to try not to come out too much. Uh, yeah, we'll do something like this. That'd be fun. Okay. So now we have the aluminum, this side there. Now we're going to need to get these ones to the front. So we're going to use these tunnel things and we're going to bring our material to the front. Okay, and that goes there. Oops. And make sure you click on it. And that goes there. Then we got our materials coming out here. Now, if we look here, we have the titanium here and it's here. So we can join these two belts up. Same thing with the iron. Iron is now joined up. And now, if we look at these arrows, they're pointing inwards. So we know which way the material is flowing, right? So in order to make this all work, so that way these things don't get confused, we have to build this now. Because if we build it, if we don't, these aren't going to know what direction they are when we come to do the next setup, all right? Kind of, kind of weird, but it's just how it is. Okay, so now we have the purple on the top. So now we need to get the purple down here. So I was just going to do something like this. Like this. And like that. And then you do the same thing on the other side. Do one here, one here, and one there. We go back to our belts. Oh, did I put that in the right spot? Oopsie. Let's go back here. There we go. Now let's go for our belts. We can connect this one to that one, this one to that one, and then these should be connected. These should be connected. And then we can just take, I should bring these out just a little bit more.
We'll just like that. And then we can connect this one and this one. And we'll build that. So now we know that all of our materials for these two machines are now making it all the way to the front. Now we just got to kind of do the reverse to this one right here, right? So this side, do do, or did I put that one on backwards? I think I put this one on backwards. Yeah, purple there. I did these two. I was supposed to, yeah, I was supposed to flip this one. Oops. I'm pretty sure anyways. Uh, so the purple is down now. And I'm three across. That's good. Yeah, yeah. Because now I got to go join the iron, which is this one here in the middle. That's true. All right. So now we're good. Now we're good. All right. So we got purple, purple. We join the purple. We join purple. Arrows are pointing outwards on these ones. That's good. Um, that's done. Now we got to get to the iron and stuff. And we go like this. We go here. And we go here. Then we connect this one to there, this one to there, then these to here, like that, then this to here. Now you see the arrows, they're flowing inwards. If you would have done this beforehand, it wouldn't have really known where the arrows are going, and it would have just switched the arrows. It's kind of weird. That's what it did to me anyway, so I figured out <clears throat> that I had to do it like that. And then you can go build. And now all these materials are taken care of. So now everything is coming to the front. So now we can have our our input for that there. And then we can just bring that down to this machine. And then we can bring it down to this machine. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then as we need more of these, well, we can just go upwards with them, right? And we'll just collect more material from them. So now next part um we'll build that and then that will be good now next part is storage we're going to use these uh, small mini storages i think they're going to be just fine because they're going to be kind of like a small buffer between all of our machines so that way we can back up eventually but hopefully that's not going to be the case right um i'm going to go two out I'm going to do this, this, and that. Then we're going to go back to belts. Um, yep, like this. And you like that. You put them over here. And I bet you, uh, oh, you actually worked out. Here. That's nice. And then we build those. Now, uh, we'll go to belts. This one is going to be the aluminum this one is going to be the silicon oxide this one should be iron and then this one should be titanium beautiful see that all worked out just fine uh, famous last words okay so now from here we need to get stuff smelted all right um, so we're going to go in here, smelting furnace. Now I, um, I don't remember the spacing for this one though. I know I didn't do them straight on. Um, I know I was off a little bit. Damn it. <laughs> I, had it I had it looking pretty good too. Um, because I did like three per each. Oh, crap. Uh, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two. 
Okay. All right. I was trying to find our spacing again. So what's in the middle? Um, I'll be back. All right. So I got it kind of sorted out here now. Um, this is about as even as I can get it because it's like odd numbers, even numbers and odd placements here. Anyways, this is about as nice as I can get it. So the goal was just to start off with two. So I'm just going to delete each one for now. And then we'll upgrade it as we need to go and kind of like optimize it, right? So this way we're saving on material at the beginning and costs of belts and stuff like that to get go, right? All right, Sue, so, what are you? Okay, you're going to be the purple stuff. So I should let them kind of build this and keep going maybe. Otherwise, it's just going to be a hell of a workload maybe for them. Um, because I want this destroyed too. I need kind of all of this to get destroyed, which... All right. Um... Damn it. <laughs> I'm really, I'm really considering like just letting them go. But, because uh, what I want to do with the belts, right? Um, so these are going to join together. So we'll have, like, say, like, the main belt. I don't want it too, too far. Um, yeah, like, maybe that should be fine, right? And then say, like, we had the main belt go out that way. This one is just going to join up with that one. If we had another one here, it would just obviously join up here, right? So the plan is, is that, okay, so those are the purple ones. That's fine. That's good. I was going to take like a large storage and where are we? Or about there. I got to leave room for the other one, right? So I figure that'll be good enough. And then since like these purple ones are pretty like right there, I can just kind of go something like this, right? And then. I'll feed purple crap down the line, plus I'll also store it up to like 2,000 or something like that. I, I know every container is a different amount, but it's roughly like something like that anyways. Then the next one I would have come down so that way it's uh, like this. Because I think all we have to do is keep one space in between, so that way we can just do something like this and then, you know... And we have enough research that uh, are, are they're not bad. So I don't know. I might have I might have to research that last one in order to get the the other ones in there. Otherwise, I might have to do like a a janky thing there. Oh, I wouldn't even be able to. I wouldn't be able to like kind of like put them back to back like that because there's only space for one. <laughs> All right. Um. Pondering thoughts for later. Uh, let's look at the science. What do I got going on here for science right now? Large battery. Drone battery upgrade. This could, can take a hike for now. Um, let's go here. Do, do, do. Or is it engineering? Engineering. Yes. Underground conveyor belts too. That, that would be better. Now, I think that gives me farther reach. Yeah, increases the length of connection by four cells. That's probably good enough for now for us. That was a good trade. All right, so that's going to do that. And then let's go back to belts here. So this is what I'm saying. It's going to get kind of expensive for us. Hence why we needed the, the contracts. I'm just going to put the belt to there. And then we'll go here. And then this will be the last one. Perfect. Uh, no, that one's not right. Crap. That means I gotta delete these. Perfect. I guess I should have looked at that the first time, right? Uh, can I just continue? I can. Okay, so that one's going to be right. That's good. Let's just do it right now, so that way 
I got it. All right. And then I'll be just fine. Yeah, yeah. Good enough. Uh, that's connected. That's connected. This needs to get connected. All right. So that would have been technically all good. So let's just... Oh, insufficient funds. <laughs> all right. So we'll have to let it run. Let the other one get over there and... Um, and sell his sell his stuff sell the fuel so he's almost there so i won't have much waiting time and in the meantime i will get them to get rid of this and this that 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 all this crap um there's anything else here here there and we'll just leave it up for now. And then that way we can put storage here. And then over here, I think what I'll do is I'll put like a regolith. Yeah, right there. A regolith thing there. Oh, I can't. But anyways, not yet. <laughs> um, and then I'll just make this one regolith and we'll do that and then hopefully by the time well yeah definitely by the time i come back it's gonna be ready but anyways yeah so that's that and i'm gonna let that play out and i'll be back okay so we seem to have everything built now um that's good that's very very good we're very low on money but uh we can fix that that's not a not an issue so we have all the appropriate materials that are going to get stored here. So we got like what? 2048 of each, just like Minecraft. Um, just perfect. So that's good. Now, I think what we're going to do is uh, let's turn it on. I guess we'll just uh, connect to this one, right? Sounds good. All right, so that'll get connected. And then I think what we'll do is we'll start dismantling all of these. So anything like this, we're just going to get all destroyed, I think. And then that's good. We're going to get some materials and some money back from doing all of this, which is good. I'm not saying that it's not good. It's good. Um, and then what will happen is our drones are going to be, like, extremely bloody busy. Because I'm going to have all this stuff deleted. Um, and the bricks, I'm going to set up a smart brick factory here, I think. Um, because that's what that was, right? I think we're going to set it up here, and then, <clears throat> I don't know, it's it's so so iffy. How much did that have left? See, that still had 30,000 units left, but anyways, we'll see, how, we'll see how it goes. We'll try to pull off a portion of it to make bricks here, and then we'll put a, a large brick one here. So, let's do that now. Um, so, let's switch these. So let's say we'll do something like something like that, right? Then we know slag is on this side, and then that is there. Not really connecting like that though. It looks so weird. Maybe because like I don't know. That is the connection point though. It just looks weird. We'll just let it go. Um, then it's going to need power. I guess we'll pull power from here. Go back to builds. We'll build those. Um, just, I guess, we'll see like if they actually go in or not, right? Uh, let's do it. Let's build it and find out. Because, like, it just looks like it's off. Like, it, I don't know. That's just me. Research complete. It's delivered. Oh, cargo. What did we get? 
I sent the drone to go get some uh, stuff on his way back. Research complete. Cargo dock. All right. Um, let's go back down. I want to see this thing get completed. <coughs> uh, what are we missing? Construction. That's it. All right. Well, as janky as it looks, shit's going in. And I don't like it. I really don't. Uh, it just doesn't look right. <laughs> Can't do it. Can't do it, boys. Even that just looks like crap. It's weird. Why does it look like that? That's going to kind of bother me, but whatever. Um, I guess it is what it is. Strange, strange game. Whatever. Alright. Uh, hitting the wrong buttons here, man. Alright, so you're going to go. Some of it's going to go here. That's fine, I guess. We're going to build a large storage. Exit is there. Go like this. Build. And you shall be for bricks. Now, we'll let that go. And we'll see how, how things go here. So obviously, we're not going to get like a crazy flow, I guess. I guess it's going to depend on how much stuff we get pumping through here, right? But they're also just picking up everything that's on the ground too right now, so I'm sure once we get these things flowing with more material, it'll help. Possibly. Alright, so let's check that out right now then. So, the first one I'm going to connect, I guess, is this one right here, since it's like the closest, right? <clears throat> Um, I guess for now, until I decide if I need to put another one of these in, then I could just, um, actually, you know what? Why even wait? Why even wait? So, I just gotta make sure that I don't block one of those entrances that I have kind of like pre set up. Ah, that's not good. Um,. say oh no I should be okay here because the other one is right here so if I put one here I should be okay yay famous last words all right so you're gonna have you come out here like this into there build all perfect so now you just need uh, power. I'll give you power from here. All right, and then I'll turn you back on and I will even upgrade you and that will just suck all the last little bit of money I have. But then we can just go look at a contract very quick and see if there's anything in here that we can fulfill for some cheap cash. And this looks like the winner. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. So we can send you that, and we can send you that. And that gives me like 60 grand. So we'll unpause, we'll let them do that. We'll go in. Yeah, my drone's got a lot to take care of right now, so. But at least we'll have some regolith coming in. That looks nice. That looks pretty clean. I like that. Very good. Director, our main account balance has reached a critical low. Oh, t -t -t lady, I know, okay? What, did you just give me like 30 grand? Really? Are you serious? Wow, that's awesome. I wish all banks did that. <laughs> all right, so, 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 so. And then um, what I think, too, is... 
I'm wondering if, like, say these, they remember that it's a... Probably not. It's because it's just a five. Yeah, it's whatever. You get five regularly if you get one of each. It has nothing to do with the percentage anymore or what's in here, right? That's true. That's true. All right, so they're doing pretty good. Um, I think... I think, I think, I think that's what I'm going to do right now is I'm just going to destroy everything in between this episode and let them kind of like dismantle everything, let this kind of stuff back up and all that good stuff. And then in the next episode, what we'll do is we'll, we'll refinish our, our automation that we have already set up of different things. And then, um, we'll just extend the line. We'll do... We'll pull items off, <clears throat> and then we'll send them through, I guess, the finished product up here. And we'll do that all along. And we'll see how well that goes. And, uh, yeah, so this was a multi-regolith refinery. I hope you enjoyed the video, everybody. Peace, take care, and we'll see you next time.